Okay, this is Sports Stuff Reviews again. I'm doing a review on the UA Fierce 3 gloves. Um, I would be doing the UA Possession 3 gloves right now, but they were stolen at school. I don't know how, but they were stolen. Anyway, um, someone got hold of them. <clears throat> I'm going to be doing a grip test, a fill test, and um, a padding test. Well, not really a padding test. I'm just going to talk about the padding. Okay, and then I'm going to read off the package, basically. Okay, it's for running backs and linebackers. The ultimate hybrid, super sticky and protective. But that's not always true. I mean, a lineman could use these too because the padding's pretty good, but you have flexible fingers so you can get a three-point stance and everything. Four-point stance, whatever you do. It depends on how your uh, coaches teach you, I guess. Um, or how you prefer. Um, it's got grab tech, so it gets sticky. And um, it's scientifically proven to be twice as sticky as some other gloves. Basically the older Under Armour gloves. Um, it's compression, molded padding, lightweight, ventilated armor mesh, and that's the back of the hand. The palm is armor grab tech palm, and rollover thumb. Customizable locker tag for player name and number. Meets NFHS and NCAA specifications. Okay, excuse me for a moment when I put on the glove on my left hand. <laughs> Okay, I got it on the left hand, and here's how it looks. Um, the palm is super sticky, as you can tell just by looking at it with the camera view. It has that uh, like a shiny plastic type rubber look that uh, some of the other gloves have. Um, but that's basically because I have it in the light. Like over here in the out of the light, you can still see the shininess, just to a lesser degree. Um, the camera can't pick it up as well as your eyes can actually see it. Um, the molding, let's see, look at my fingers, I can go super quick and it's, but it's, it's kind of, it's tough, but it's not the toughest ever. The Possession 3's had a little bit tougher, um, if you're looking for super padding, uh, pretty much the best you can get is the UA Possession 3's. If you're a lineman, you can get the UA Combat 2's, they're like the best padding for linemen. And it's got, it, it's got it on the thumb, too, but it stops up here at the thumb now. That, that kind of makes sense, because that's where the joint is the majority of the time. Like, right here. Oh, my God, that just... So you can actually bend it, but it keeps it from getting jacked up at the base. It's got this little meshy material. It kind of feels like um, what the warp speeds have. I might do a review on them eventually. I do not have them right now. I'm going to purchase them in the future, most likely. It just has the standard Velcro grip. I'm going to take a... Uh, Lay down the camera for a second to show you something else. Okay, I know this is not how it's done, but because I'm trying to show you something. Anyway, you know the way you can do that on the Nike and it shows the Nike symbol? I wish Under Armour would have one of those. And we need to send, like, a petition. Sign a petition, yeah. That'll work. I'm just kidding. Anyway, I wish Under, Arm Under Armour had their logo right here where you fold it up right here. And... On the bottom, the locker tag's right there. That's all I wanted to show you. You don't actually fold up the bottom when you're showing off your side. Hold up. Alright, that should look better. Yep. Um, it's got this nice foamy material right here. You can hear the noise. It's got that, like, uh, it's like cushiony, cottony stuff. And, uh, I'm gonna do a grip test now. Okay, here's the Under Armour football. If you want to see that, um, I should have an annotation in the top of the, le the top left screen. That'll send you to the previous video, and that'll be on the Storm hoodie. And if you click it, if you click previous video again, that will send you to the Gripskin football review. Wait, no, that'll uh, no, it'll send you to the channel update. Anyway, just check out my other videos if you want to see this. I should have an annotation to see the Storm hoodie though, or sweatshirt, whatever. Okay, so I can do it with three fingers right here, easy. Okay, and now I can do it with uh, two fingers. Yeah. Okay, I'm starting to lose grip a little bit. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm gonna try to get up here. It's now that is pretty good. If I do say so myself. Um, this is what I'm gonna. This is what I'm going to be using for next year's football season. I'm gonna do a more in depth, in depth, in depth review. Yeah, on the gloves when the season actually starts. So this has been Sports Stuff Reviews, and I'll see you later.